Welcome to another video of SyncPix. In today's video, I'll show you how we can install Elementary OS 7. It is built on Ubuntu 22.04 LTS. And so I have given you a quick review of Elementary OS 7.0. So here is a blog also that I have written here. You can see the system requirements. So it needs the dual core 64 bit processor 4 gb of ram or more of course and 32 gb of hard disk for the storage internet access and bootable flash drive so i'll be installing it on the oracle virtual box i have already downloaded elementary 7.0 stable release i'll create a new machine here which will be elementary os 7 and here it will be of course linux and oracle linux 64 bit and it needs 4 gb of minimum ram so i'll be going for 4 gb and two core processors so i'll be going for 40. well let me go back here in settings and attach the iso file here on the disk elementary os okay power it on now just start it go for full screen mode First of all, we'll choose the language, United States, select, and then US keyboard, next. So you have two options to install, and you can try it. So I'll be going for erase the entire disk and then install it. All right, so installation is completed. So I'll be simply shutting it down for the time being. I will go here, settings and storage. The disk has already been removed, started. And now I'll choose my username here. All right, so device name will be elementary OS 7, finish setup. So I'll be choosing dark mode. Most of the times I use dark mode. On the deck, you can see here multitasking view. You can see the web browser, your videos, photos, and app center. I'll first of all go for the basic settings here. A right click and display setting, change wallpaper and system setting. So in display setting, I can go here right now. Of course, I'm using the virtual machine. So that's why it doesn't recognize the display. So you can go here and change the resolution. So screen resolution 16 ratio 9. Keep the changes and I'll make sure this is on full screen right now. Background, you can change the wallpaper from here by right clicking. Here is the app center. In app center, you can see various applications. After that, there is system settings. So what is your default web application? So web browser is this. What is your default mail client? You can choose here. If I go to startup, so there is no startup a launch of the application. So I can add any application that I want to use on startup. So all the permission can be set here. So which application has permission to what? Now, for example, web, it needs the permission to network. Of course, you can give the permission to uh, access the devices like uh, microphone and webcam whenever it is needed. So it has a better, better control of permission right now. To go back to all settings, you can scale the text size in case you are comfortable with so 1.5 scale. So you can set the screen time, you can set the system performance. So you can check for updates in case you want to see updates. I'll go to applications here. Just click here, you will see all these applications which are available. So terminal is already available here. From terminal, you can use all the commands. So here I will just upgrade it also now. Install Chrome browser also. All right, so I will rename it Chrome. So I will install it Chrome here. And I will go here to terminal. I will look for the application for terminal. So if you see here, I have the file which is available chrome.tv so I will simply do sudo app install dot slash chrome.tv and here you can see it will install the additional package here so I will just press yes
Here we can see Google Chrome is installed now. Here you can see the wired connection in the setting. You can see here network settings. And then and in case you want to disable it, you can disable also. So if you go here to advanced settings, you can change the IP address from automatic. To, you can log, you can log out, suspend or shut down. So this was all about Elementary OS 7.0.